uh, so today uh, we are off uh, to watch some basketball. Uh, we're going down to um, Durham and the Lundholm Gym to uh, go watch uh, the UNH, uh, UNH Wildcats uh, play some uh, D1 basketball. So we will uh, go check it out. It's a new one for me. I have Connor with me today. Yellow. And uh, yeah, let's go and see what it's like. All right, so we uh, we've just arrived. Yes, we just arrived in Durham, New Hampshire. That was kind of cool seeing the Amtrak train there. Just pull off from Durham Station. And uh, just over here is the uh, Lundstrom Gym, which is where UNH basketball plays. It's where we're going today. Uh, just behind me is the Whitmore Center. We'll go there at some point. That's where the ice hockey plays. Um, but for now, let's uh, check out some basketball. So we're outside the the gymnasium. Yeah. It looks pretty old. It's one of the older venues here at UNH. I'll uh, find out when it was first used and I'll put that in the bed somewhere. Anyway, we'll see you in there. back in the car after the game just finished uh, it was a big win for uh, U, -Albany. Uh, U Albany yeah it was a bit of a blowout like 30 points or something so not much of an atmosphere from the home crowd um, but uh, it was pretty neat to go uh, I got a shirt uh, yes I uh, kind of got a shirt and a t-shirt toss uh, every day is a great day to be a wildcat there we go yeah um, so a couple of hundred people in there I think capacity is 3,000 of this place so I bet it's Probably a lot more rocking when it's full, but uh, again, pretty cool to go to. Um, overall, nice one to tick off. Um, and uh, kind of a nice old, uh, old arena here. I think uh, I saw it was uh, dedicated in 1968. So that's how old it was. Um, but anyway, nice cool experience. Uh, let's uh, head from home. We'll see you next time. See ya.